back to the CFP, and art history. Truth embraces with it all other abstentions other than itself. Outside time, outside space, parallels other durations, oblivious to the deliberate brilliance of its own time, mortal, deliberate, marking, oblivious to itself, but to sing, to sing too, very softly. At York University, a university without condition, there is no good reason to put a limit to thought within the setting of the university. One must allow in the mad, the chimeric, the deviant, the teratological. In Toronto, on November 1, 2013.
more events that might be of beginning to curate the cut if it's staging this to be decayed so I speculate in the aesthetics of somewhat lengthy and so the gallery of down continues to event and my comments I just seems to cut before it is as if quite disturbed the managing to the going to be held that all nice with the bit so
Countries also to celebrate in past pardons and women is a kind of order there which quite what uh way earlier is a fourth year. It's similar knowledge of initial top music that up for making. Yeah, 
for the linguistic churn. The monstrous demonstrates the limits of the thinkable. Hence, we can discern its presence in the porosity of discourse or in the incapacity of discourse to render the monstrous in its full monstrosity. Before the curatorial turn, to posit taciturnity as a tactical wedge between the silencer and the silence is not to increase the distance between the two, but, but to activate their entwining, to accent the turn in taciturn. Before the educational turn, perhaps the mentor can be viewed as a teacher beyond teaching, as a teacher who rephrases the now prevalent institutional catchphrase, learning outcomes, to learning how comes. Before the speculative turn, the monster monstrates and demonstrates. Before the monstrous turn and after the ontological debacle it causes. Before the sonic turn, a sonic fully irrigated by materiality. Before all those turns, there was Plato's turn in the Cratylus, which depicted, depicted the dizziness of philosophers encountered once they realized that the only constant was instability and ephemerality. By the dog, I believe I have a fine intuition which has just come to me and that the very ancient men who invented names were quite like most of the present philosophers who always get busy as they turn round and round in their search for the nature of things. And then the things seem to them in turn round and round and be in motion. They think the cause of this belief is not an affection within themselves, but the nature of things really is such that nothing is at rest or stable, but everything is flowing and moving and always full of constant motion and generation. This paradoxical conclusion was the impetus for the dual undo's audio work, Detournage. To say I like sad is to have no relation to sad at all. Sad cannot be liked. No one can stand him. For what he writes turns us away absolutely by attracting us absolutely. The attraction of the detour. Thank <laughs> you.